Hi, I'm Willie. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. What we're going to talk about today is ingress protection or IP ratings. And I'm actually going straight to the source for this one. Um, because as you're looking at where you can use certain types of equipment, it's very important to understand the ingress protection rating, how to read it, how to reference it, and then make sure you're installing equipment um, in an uh, appropriate you know, manner. Uh, before we get to that, if you need IT consulting, head on over to willyhow.com, click hire us or contact us, fill that information out and someone will be in touch with you as soon as possible. The other ways that you can support the channel is all of our clearly marked affiliate links are down below. Thank you again. All right, so let's take a look at the Ingress Protection or IP Ratings Guide. You always hear, you know, uh, somebody say, well, this thing is IPX5 or IP67 rated. Well, what does that mean? Well, <laughs> you really should at least be able to reference it and understand what it is. I don't expect anybody to memorize this. Uh, there, there is a guide for this. The guide can be updated. It can be changed at any time. So always reference this. So these are standards that organizations have set. So I'm going to leave a link to this specific one that we're looking at down below. But when we look at uh, the ingress protection ratings, you have uh, IP, which obviously stands for ingress protection, which you're going to be tired of of hearing by uh, the end of this video. Then you have the first number, and that uh, represents the solid foreign objects. And then you have the uh, second one that represents water, right? So you can see here, IP65. So if we were to take the example that they, that they created, it would be IP6. So six, we come to our uh, list over here. It says dust tight, which means dust cannot get in. And then five, if we come over here to five, it's protected against water jets. So water protected in jets, uh, water projected in jets against the enclosure from any direction shall have no harmful effects. So that IP65 is a pretty good rating. So obviously like the best ratings would be like IP68, IP69. Um, IP68 means that you can have something completely um, submerged, right? So there is, um, it says ingress of, ingress of water in quantities causing harmful effects shall not be possible when the enclosure is continuously submerged in water under conditions which shall be agreed upon between the manufacturer and user but which are more severe than number seven, right? So these build um, on top of each other. So here I have the Unify uh, Protect G4 Instant. And if we pull up the page over at the Ubiquity store for this camera, um, we can see here it says it's IPX5 rated. So what does IPX5 rating mean? Let's go back over to our chart. So there's an X, so it's IPX. So X has no rating. So it is not dust uh, protected. It is not uh, protected from anything like a hand, a finger. And you can see on these, on the chart, it shows, uh, you know, a hand, a finger, a screwdriver, a strap, uh, and then you get down into the dust. So since this has no dust protection, it means I can touch it, you know, with my hands. There's no protection uh, from solid foreign objects. Then if we go over to five, it says it's projected against water, protected against water jets. So water projected in jets against the enclosure from any direction shall have, shall have no harmful effects. So the way that this is built um, once it's mounted, we could spray it in any direction and the camera will be okay. It cannot be submerged, but it can be sprayed. So this is extremely important when you're looking at uh, mounting access points, where to mount them, cameras, where to mount them, uh, any type of equipment that you're going to put outside, make sure you check the IP rating. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Please comment, share. Please follow me on Twitter and TikTok. Those links are down below along with the Hire Us uh, link and all of our clearly marked 
affiliate links. Once again, I'm Willie. I want to thank you for being here. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.